There we go. There he is. Yay, that's a nice one. Yeah. Pretty colors on that one, Chad. What do you got there? The swim bait going, huh? Yeah, yep. Hi, folks. Today on Midwest Outdoors, we're up in the North Metro. We're chasing largemouth early season. We're in the boat with Chad Grigsby. Chad's an FLW touring pro, and he's a Blackfish Gear Pro staff guy. In the front of the boat, we got Matt Johnson. Matt runs the Blackfish Gear Pro staff. Kind of a cloudy, rainy day. Perfect day to be in the Blackfish Gear. We're going to catch some more largemouth just like that. Getting the fresh ones? Yeah, nice one. Get them in here. There you go. That's what we're looking for right there. Oh, nice one. Now you find that chatterbait at this time of year, we're, we're going in about four to six foot going over different weed clumps, right? Yeah, we're just, I'm, I'm purning over the top and every once in a while you'll hit grass and I hit it on that and when you pop it free, it's kind of like an old rattle yep. trap bite when you pop that off that grass and it triggers the bite. Yep, it's a good way to cover the flat, it seems. Yep. Nice one. Yep, good fish. He ate it. He ate it. Oh. He come up and smack it, or did he grab it like uh, the oh, other ones? It. Yep, that's All a these neat fish thing. Just push it. Yeah, them bites when the colder weather, they're coming up and grabbing it and pushing it forward. You know, today we got a chilly day. That uh, you know, this gear is nice to have on. It's kind of raining a little bit, but it's actually a good wind block. It's pretty breathable too. Absolutely. So I mean, wing suits are meant to be waterproof. Yep. but I want to be dry on the inside yep. too. So no matter the conditions, you know, this event technology yep. keeps you dry on the inside. It, it just evaporates the moisture. Catch. So lets me stay in the water longer. Yeah, you can catch a lot of fish on a day like this if you can take it out here. Oh, oh fish. Oh yeah. Oh good one. Oh. Good one, Chad. There you go. That's fun when they do that to you, huh? Yeah, yeah that's a good one. These, a lot of rain gears are the same, but these have so many different little little things that I like about them. And I've actually got another hood on, but when it's raining, raining, yep. I'm pulling my big hood up. And a lot of times when we fish on the tour, you got to run from spot to spot. Yep. And that that hood will puff up like it feels like it's going to pull your head over. Yep. Well, this has a little vent in the back. When you cinch it down, you're running 60, 70 miles an hour across yep. the lake to get to your next spot. Yep. You don't have that pull back. You got the vent in the back. It's awesome. That's one of the reasons I like this rain suit. And that's one of the reasons I like catching these guys right here. Beauty. <laughs> Black and blue is doing this to it. Give me a fish. Slimy, yeah, slimy. Give him, to, give him to Chad. Wipe it on the rain gear. That's one of the great things about uh, the, the blackfish gear, though. It's washable, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, and, and actually, it's something you guys encourage people to do where a lot of times manufacturers don't right absolutely so if you get dirt on it it actually clogs the pores and the pores help it breathe yep so you can wash these event fabric as much as you want other brands will tell you not to wash them as much because it can hinder waterproofing so oh, yeah, wash definitely. them as much as you want <sighs> wrestle them <sighs> you know fishing that chatterbait that's a great strike a lot like a crankbait <laughs> pop that out of there let him go a little chunky guy Can't even tell what's in there. They're in the weeds. Yeah. <laughs> Chewed up. You ate it. When you take a look at that blackfish rain gear map, you know, one of the first things you notice is the zipper's a little different. Definitely a unique design, huh? Absolutely. Their YKK waterproof zippers keeps the elements out. That zipper is an important piece of the equation. You know, when you look inside the suit, especially the bibs, these straps, magnetic. Yep. I didn't push a button. They stay on nice and neat, real, real comfortable. Underneath here, you notice the silicone. Okay. They don't slide off when I'm casting, when I'm setting hooks, the straps aren't sliding up and down. Yeah. Bib's super comfortable. The wrists, the ankles, you have the cinch straps. You got that neoprene sleeve that holds you down tight. I cinch it down. If I'm fishing like this all day, water's not coming in. Same thing with my cuffs on the bottom. Definitely. Very, very comfortable. And then overall fishability, you've watched us. We're moving, we're casting, we're yeah. fishing bass. It's an overall super comfortable cut and sew of this suit so you can stay in the water longer and catch more fish. Yeah. Billy Bass.
Well, that's a great day of bass fishing. Caught some northerns in there too at shallow water, fast action. Chatterbait's a good way to do it. Tell you what, we got a day here that'd be easy to stay home, but when you got some great rain gear like this, Matt, easy to get out and do it, Absolutely. huh? Absolutely. How do they find out more information about Blackfish? Go to blackfishgear.com or find us on Facebook. Folks, for Matt Johnson and Chad Grigsby, I'm Greg Jones. More Midwest Outdoors is coming right up.